drawing um, it usually ends up in a completely different place to where I planned and they're usually the best drawings. Um, when I first pick up the piece of charcoal and see the model I'm in my head trying to imagine how it's going to look on the paper and I find the best results usually come when I start to draw what I want to be there rather than what's actually there. When did you start to draw? I think I started drawing in my early teens. I started reading comic books and really loving that style of art and the way actions conveyed um, and decided I wanted to be a comic book artist. So spent many hours behind a drawing board after school and I think, yeah, that carried me through my teens and then got a bit older and decided that maybe that wasn't the way to go. But I think it's really carried through into my current drawing in the fact that I try and show movement or dynamic poses, which is something I learnt when I was studying comic book art how to make the figure look like it's moving or the most dynamic pose possible. So that's definitely influenced. How, how does I draw. life drawing fit in with being a graphic designer? And why did you become a graphic designer? I should we should ask. I suppose I became a graphic designer because I wanted to be creative but still wanted to have a career path that I could follow and know that I could hopefully get work in the industry after I finish school. So that took me down that path and graphic design has become very computer based. So you spend most of your time at a desk behind the computer um, working with various layout programs. So I love life drawing because it's the only time in the day where I get to stand up and step away from the computer and be completely creative without having a brief or without having What do you anyone. think about the difference between drawing on paper and drawing in the computer? I find drawing on paper just a lot more natural, I suppose, um, given the way I, I used to draw. Um, I think drawing on the computer can be a lot freer if you use a, a Wacom pad or some other sort of tablet but I don't have much experience using those so I'm usually drawing if I do illustration on the computer it's usually with a mouse and it's a lot more technical um, whereas I find life drawing to be a lot more expressive and I noticed that you work relaxed. mostly with charcoal why is that? I think the final outcome of the artwork is so dependent on the material you use um, and I just find that charcoal suits my natural d drawing style of um, black and white quite contrasty but also allowing me to use cross hatching and line based artwork but also the flexibility to blend the charcoal and give me a, a gradient um, gives me a lot of freedom if I want to lay down some large areas of black I can just use a thicker piece of charcoal and fill in and any for large areas color, I quite enjoy clean. using chalk pastels uh, for similar reasons I can blend the colours and fill in large areas or still use line drawing or cross hatching. What about the sensual qualities of charcoal? Do you like that? Yeah I think charcoal is great because it's so tactile and it's a really hands-on experience and you get your hands dirty and you get it on your face and it makes a mess and but I think that's half the fun so, so most of it's wiped off but you can see a little bit on there the artist's hands but again it's part of getting away from the computer and actually getting more hands-on with the charcoal and there's always that element of you feel like in a way you're connecting with the great masters of the past or even further back to the earliest sort of artworks where they did use pieces of charcoal they would 
grab out of the fire and create artwork on cave walls or wherever they could and you definitely sometimes feel a bit of a connection to that, that history of art when you're using charcoal which I really enjoy. So what are you trying to do with this drawing? I suppose I'm trying to capture Olivia the moment of her lying there looking very peaceful and beautiful and I'm not sure how successful I'm being at the moment but it's still early days so keep working on it Why is it that you draw? I think I just enjoy the creative expression of it. There's no brief. You're not trying to please anyone except yourself. And it's all a matter of trying to capture a moment on paper and I enjoy the challenge of that. Why do you come here to draw? Um, well, I first came to Tony's classes about a year and a half ago and it was made such a difference to my life because um, the space here is just it's a pure creative space the atmosphere is wonderful we have some music we have a drink or two and it's three hours um, away from the realities of life and world and jobs and all those other things and just time to focus on drawing and creating and I look forward to it every week. Do you week. like drawing in a, in a group like this? I think drawing in a group is uh, one of the best parts of, about... Um, there's something about drawing things. with other people uh, that is really encouraging and you get to share what you're all doing and everyone can collaborate or give you feedback on your work. Um, there's an atmosphere of the studio, there's the music and I just, um, compared to drawing at home by yourself, it's just a lovely atmosphere and 